how you doing? This is RP coming straight to you from Marketplace here in London. And tonight we're going to do a great interview with those two amazing artists, Lenny Lynn, Richard Emma Stone. We're here at Dago Restaurant. What else can you ask for? They're from State North. You heard of them, and if you haven't, you will. Let's go do it. What exactly is the Stay North Project? Basically, like, Stay North is myself and Richard Emberstone. Um, we come together as a collaboration, rapper and singer, producer, songwriter, and um, we're just literally here to make music, make videos, and just project our creativity out there for the public, really. And we've come under the umbrella of Stay North Project. Um, it's something we believe in and it means a lot to us, so that's what it's about. I mean, how did you guys come up with the name Stay North? What do you represent? <laughs> uh, do we want to tell the true story about that? <laughs> please, please, come on. We need uh, to know, we need to know. You might tell it better than I me, mean, bro. Well, Stay North is, it, what it means is basically to stay focused, mm. to stay positive, to stay determined yeah. and to keep on your game to, to, to just stay doing what you're doing. So when we say to somebody stay north, it just means you know keep doing what you're doing, stay positive about what you're doing and um, keep moving forward. Yeah, just keep moving forward, keep progressing. Yeah. And um, Richard came up with the actual stay north mantra because I was getting a little bit distracted by certain things out there, right. certain <laughs> people should I say. Mm. And um, he kept saying to me, yo, stay north, bro, stay north. And we're from North London, so that's where the north came in, like, stay north. And um, it just, it, it does focus you, because even if we're now doing stuff together and we can feel each other maybe going in different directions, we'll tell each other to stay north. And it just means a lot to us in terms of staying focused, so that's where it came from. Nice, nice. I beg I cease fire from the youths round here Too much genocide, are you loops round here? No, my gun should really get shoot round here You'll all be dead or wearing jail suits round here Journalists are looking for the scoop round here Five already just to swoop round here The one the handcuffs and execute round here Riot shields and taser guns to round here oh, oh, Okay, my fuckers ain't telling the truth round here They're lying when they step into the booth round here I've heard a lot about the song Round Here can you, just, can you um, expand on that, Rich? Um, I could, but that one's more for Lyndon, really. <laughs> I mean, um, Lyndon came up with a, a concept uh, called Round Here. He'd written a song Round Here that he uh, he rapped to me one night out in a nightclub, and I said, yeah, you know what? I love this concept, which I'm going to get Lyndon to talk to you about in a minute. Right. I just fell in love with the concept straight away. He started to rap it to me, and I was like, dude, that's hot, that's hot. Come to the studio, we've got to record that. Mm. We came down to the studio, I just built the track then and there. Just tell me about the subject. Um, the concept is just about where we live, and it could be anywhere. You could be North London, East London, West London, South London, it's all the same. So it was just talking about what happens around here in your area, and it was kind of just after, just before the riots happened throughout the country, and some of the things I was saying in the song were kind of relevant to what was happening around that time. So um, the whole concept was really just about living in an area where things are going on that maybe we agree or don't agree with and I just wanted to, to say round here because everyone could identify with wherever they're at is still yeah. round here so and that's, that's why we made that song. Tell, you know, tell us a little bit about your singing style. Uh, I mean, as an artist, uh, it's, it's been an evolution, you know. Um, I started out in the game really singing a lot of R&B tracks, um, featuring on other artists' hip-hop tracks, 
and over the years my, my delivery, my style has changed a lot as I've matured as well. Um, it's a lot more edgy, um, at the same time as well it's a lot more poppy and when I say poppy, uh, I see myself as a pop producer, I'm very eclectic, I produce everything and pop is popular music, so it's whatever is hot. Um, and um, I have a, uh, an edgy style that basically sits over everything that I do, that I fit into everything that I do, whether I'm producing a hip hop track, a rock track, R&B track, dubstep, whatever it's going to be. And um, I make it and it fits under the stain or banner. But you're going to hear things that are soulful, you're going to hear things that are a bit rocky, you're going to hear things that are a bit of R&B, but you'll always know that it's Emberstone here. Gotcha, that sounds, that sounds awesome. I'm ready to spit, what? Ready to make them hits, what? Amplified by the killer, what? Surging hard right up to the spot. Ride the wave like I slip, no. Apologies for me, I'm sick. For all the fans out there that's watching, um, just want to say stay north. Keep focus on what you're doing, whatever your game is. Keep on doing what you're doing, stay determined. And like, you're going to see and hear a lot more Lindsay and Richard Emberstone, the Stay North project. We've got stuff coming out, we're gonna go on tour, we're gonna be out there reaching the people. So yep, yep. everybody just keep focused and stay north. Stay north.